Hello everyone, in this Hilding Shorts, I am going to tell you about a squamous cell carcinoma of the lung which is most commonly associated with smoking and most common mutation is the P53 tumor suppressor gene mutation and on immunohistochemical examination, remember they will be positive for cytokeratin 7 and 20 will be negative. So cytokeratin 7 positive 20 minus cytokeratin 5 and 6 both will be positive and there are two new marker we have to remember P40 and P63. P40 and P63 they are positive for the squamous cell cancer of the lung. So squamous cell cancer we can divide into three grade well differentiated, moderately differentiated or poorly differentiated. What is the difference? Well differentiated squamous cell cancer will be having keratin pulse which is a eosinophilic concentric whorl seen inside the tumor cell right <coughs> moderately differentiated squamous cell cancer they will be having cytoplasmic bridging right so that is called as intercellular bridging it is for moderately differentiated so, and when you do not find keratin pearl or no intercellular bridging right so there is no keratin pearl no intercellular bridging so that will be the poorly differentiated squamous cell cancer how we will diagnose them by using the immunohistochemistry cytokeratin, cytokeratin will be positive p40 p63 all these things will be positive look at the histopathology right so now you can see in the histopathology you can notice there are concentric keratin pearls so these are well differentiated because we are seeing eosinophilic concentric whorls of the cytokeratin which we are seeing in all these diagrams right so that is the that is the keratin pearl and well differentiated squamous cell carcinoma now this is the moderately differentiated squamous cell carcinoma as i have told you they will be having intercellular bridging and you can see there are intercellular bridging in between th these tumor cell right so whenever you find intercellular bridging it is a moderately differentiated squamous cell carcinoma and poorly differentiated squamous cell carcinoma as you can see there is nothing visible and you can notice there is a cohesive tumor cells which is growing and they are not well differentiated right so neither you are seeing any keratin pearl nor intercellular bridging so no keratin pearl no intercellular bridging when you are seeing that means it is a poorly differentiated how we will diagnose isc marker cytokeratin positive p40 positive and p63 positive enjoy learning best